my lovelies i hope you're all well so today we are looking at contour again we're in design space and as we've discovered you can do lots of wonderful things with contour however if your lines or your cuts are combined then everything is going to disappear or reappear with that contour you will come across images where actually you want to create layers from areas which are combined. So for example, I want the hair to be a different colour to the rest of the body. And currently, because those lines are combined, even if I contour away the rest of it, that outline is going to consist of the hair because the hair is combined to the outline so i'm just going to change the color on him so we can see a bit better and what i want to do is separate the hair here and then here so that i can then create a separate layer for them so i'm going to go to shapes and grab a square i'm going to unlock the square and we're going to make the width 0 0.05. We don't need it to be very thick at all. And I'm just going to reduce the height to 1. And I'm going to duplicate that so that I've got two of them. I can bring this one over and just place that. And then this one, I can rotate it. And then again place that. Now because we're going to be using the contour we can't use the combine and subtract because it keeps the layers. So we have to use slice for this. So whether you are on beta, whether you are on live desktop or you're on the app, it's all the same method for this. We're going to use slice. Now you can only slice two layers at a time We've got three layers here. So what we're actually going to do is hold down our shift key and select our other line. We're going to come to combine and weld so that they become one complete layer. It's just a way of being able to slice multiple things at once. If I then draw around and make sure that I've got both layers selected, I can then select slice. That's going to give me my slice results. I don't need those, so I can delete the slice cuts, leaving me with my giraffe with its two gaps now. I can then duplicate this, and we're going to duplicate it three times. Select all three layers, align and center so that they're perfectly on top of each other. I'm going to make that top layer an orange. Open up my contour. I'm going to hide all contours. Bring back my hair layer. And then take away the top layer. My next layer I'm going to keep yellow. Again open up my contour. And this time I'm just going to remove his little spots. And then that last layer, I'm going to make a brown, open up my contour, hide all contours, bring my spots back, and then remove my top layer. And so by creating that slice, rather than having the entire outline, one layer, one color, I've been able to separate it and create an extra layer. I hope this has been helpful. Any comments or questions, please do leave them below. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell. As always, thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you all again soon. Bye.